Hello, session 15 of Actor Prepares. Today, I cannot believe that we have covered 75% of the course. Feels a bit sad because it's gonna be soon over, but it's still been a really fun journey so far. What we looked into today was about conflicts. So we looked at the types of conflict, the wants and the motivation behind these conflict or, or conflicting situations. How do you look at the script and then see what are these fundamental changes that you can bring to your acting by analyzing the conflict, understanding the want, understanding the motivation behind. And we looked into the three types of conflicts, physical conflict uh, and mental conflict, internal and external. So. Pretty much physical conflict is external, mental conflict is internal, and then you have conflicts with your co-actors. Physical conflict could be anything that is a conflict in the physical world but interrupts with your intended thought. So it's a conflict between the mind and the body. So let's say I wanna uh, I wanna go walking, but I intend to walk in a normal pace but somehow I stumble. That stumbling was not intended but it happens. And sometimes in the script you need to introduce this but not overdo it. Internal conflicts, uh, there are various kinds again within that. You have situational conflicts, you want to do something but you cannot do it because of the situation. You have uh, emotional conflicts, you are feeling one emotion but another emotion comes in and then you are in a dilemma, you are having your own internal thoughts that are fighting against each other. You have conflicts with your co-actors based on the script. So looking into this is, is uh, quite interesting and, and bringing all of this together, wants, emotions, motivation, how we project the body, how we project the voice, how we use each and every nuance that we have been learning so far. So the next exercise for us is to learn uh, one of the scripts that we will analyze for all that we have learned and then start playing it out. Will be very interesting, but I will keep you updated on it and I wish you a very nice day again.